We're back. But uh, checks for cows. Go ahead, ask me how. That's right, so easy. Just write a check or pay with PayPal to give your donation. Hello, I'm Betsy, and I'm back to say thank you to you, our Fulton families, for your generosity last year that helped put computers into the hands of our students. We were able to purchase one cow per grade. Our goal is again to raise $100 per student for a school goal of $100,000. This will let us bring in more cows to roam our school halls and classrooms. Bella, what are some of the advantages to having cows and laptops in the class? Well, everybody gets their own and they load a lot faster than normal computers. How have you used cows or laptops in the classroom specifically? Can you think of an example or a project that you worked on? Well, I did autobiographies in fifth grade and we typed on them and we made PowerPoints and in science fair, we used Word. And did you think that was um, a useful tool rather than having to arrange time to go to the computer lab? Yes, very useful. Can you give me an example of when you used your laptop or cow in the classroom last year in third grade? Um, well, we had a wax museum in third grade and we had to type our biographies out. And so um, we used the cows on um, Word. So that was um, helpful because like it actually, we didn't have to keep going back and forth, back and forth. And we actually could just get it out. So, yeah. Give me an example of how you used the laptops in the classroom last year. Well, last year in reading, we did a presentation for Ojapot, and I used PowerPoint to create um, a slide. Awesome. And did you, um, do you feel like you understand PowerPoint? Yes, I do. Do you think it's easy to use these cows? It is, because they load a lot faster. So the laptops and the cows in the classroom just kind of provide you more opportunity to work with technology. Yes. Good day. I'm the cow that jumped over the moon, the celebrity cow they brought in to talk about prizes. First, the highest earning student per class gets lunch with their teacher. Next, the highest earning class gets a popcorn party. Every student that brings in funds up to $25 gets a prize from our prize card that includes Smensels, gift cards, and Fulton swag. Next, every student that brings in funds over $25 gets to pick from gift cards like Bahama Bucks, Dairy Queen, and Alamo Draft House Cinemas, or items like fidget spinners or cups full of candy. The student that raises the most money gets to name a cow, a card of computers. We will put a nameplate with the name you choose plus your name who named it. Now, here is the reigning Miss Cow America to tell you the remaining prizes. Fulton students, I'm excited to tell you that every student that brings in $100 or more will get entered to win a set of beats, one for a girl and one for a boy. And we also have one iPad mini to give to a lucky student. And last, the grade that raises the most money will get to turn Dr. Cram into a human ice cream sundae. You got it. Pour ice cream, sprinkles, whipped cream, etc. all on top of Dr. Cram. How fun! So go raise money so you can get in on the fun too. talk about the benefits of cows. Yes, we make awesome billboards, but the other cows, computers and wheels, are essential as today's students must learn 21st century skills if they are to thrive in tomorrow's world. Our workforce of tomorrow needs to be skilled in technology today. The more they are exposed to IT, the more their skill sets expand. We hope and need to keep up with social progress, so please help us make that happen. Thank you. Hi, I'm Big Mac, and as you've heard, the students want cows, not chicken, so let's do our part and give it to them. Remember, your donation is tax deductible as well. Thank you so much for your support of Fulton Elementary, and we couldn't do it without you. <laughs>